Arsenal fan TV, uh, lads, I'm going to start with you. The other night it was appalling. A lot better today. Yeah, a lot better today. Um, all I've got to say is I don't know why uh, Giroud, I know I slayed him, but why we should have kept him on and brought Sonogo on with him to give him that little bit of help. I mean, what a performance today, really, really well. The thing is, what everyone needs to realise is we've got like key players out. We've got Ozil out, Wilshire out, Ramsey out, Theo out, Bashoni out. I mean, that's five players. Five mm. players, that's, that's half the team. They're out. You know, it could be a different game if they're all there. Um, but yeah, it was... Is that, a... is that the reason why? You know what, we've, everybody's been analysing and the manager and this and that. But really and truly, when you really look at it, is that the key factor that we're missing major players? If they were missing five of their biggest players, they'd have problems, even they'd have problems. Yeah, very much problems too, Drew. After the Chelsea game, I was eating burgers. <laughs> After the Swansea game, I was eating kebabs. <laughs> After that result, it's back to the treadmill, I think. We've got a very good chance now. Five points is nothing, you know, not, not at all. Mm. I'm still going to lose the weight. There's still quite, there's still quite, listen, we can still dream. There's still quite a lot of games left. There's a lot of games left. Everyone's shouting for Wenger out, Wenger out. Last season, I've got to admit, I was a Wenger out, man. But you've got to give the geezer a chance this season. I think he's, the only person we need to get rid of is Crokey. 3%. Mm. It's, a, it's a bit of a joke, isn't it, really? Mm. It's not Wenger putting the 3%, is it? It's the owners. Mm. Mm. Now, Everton next week, um, if we can get a positive result there and then go, in, go into the FA Cup on a buzz... Yeah, big time. I was worried about the FA Cup, but after that performance, I thought we played very good too. Drew Sagan had done well. Murta Saka, big, big German. Mm. Even Chesney pulled off some miraculous saves. I thought they played well, but Giroud, he's lacking it again. It I, I think he needs to come on a treadmill with me, <laughs> have a little fitness test. <laughs> Giroud, Giroud just needs help. He needs help up front. I mean, he's one of these people that will just hold off a ball like that, and then he can you know, probably do a dink to someone else. But he's on his own, you know. I mean, yeah, fair enough. He doesn't, you know, he's a lamppost. He's, you know, he doesn't really move around. But if he actually had someone with him, you know, just to, you know, get that ball through to him, someone to support him. Because sometimes when he does get the ball, he's on his own with about 10 people around him. You know, it's not even, a, and there's no one support, there's no support with him. If he had, that's why I always like playing two strikers. I mean, fair enough, Badolski, he has a winger. But if you had, if you put Sonogo with him, probably in that last um, 10 minutes, we might have been able to turn that around.